The green and red damselflies include some of our most recognizable damselfly species. This short presentation will bring you through the main identification features for each species. The banded demoiselle is one of our most easily identified damselfly species. It's quite large for a damselfly. The wings have iridescent veins and a very characteristic dark thumb print mark. The body is metallic green. In females, there are white pseudoterostigma on the wings and a club-shaped tip to the abdomen. The Banda Demoiselle is found right across Ireland and favours slow-flowing rivers. The best place to spot it is in vegetation along the river bank. They occasionally are found in lakes and ditches. The flight period is from June until September. The beautiful demoiselle initially looks similar to the banded demoiselle, but there's important identification differences between the two species. On the male beautiful demoiselle, the wings are uniformly dark in colour, and the body has a blue-green metallic sheen. In the females, while they share the white pseudo-terostigma of the banded demoiselle, the wings of the female beautiful demoiselle are tinted brown. The beautiful demoiselle has a distribution that's limited to the southern half of the country. They favour small streams in hilly areas. Because of this, they rarely overlap in habitat with the banded demoiselle. Their flight period is June until September. Another species of green damselfly is the emerald damselfly. The emerald damselfly is notably smaller than the demoiselles. The male emerald damselfly has startling blue eyes in the mature animal. The body is metallic green bronze in colour and has blue prunescence or coloration on segments 1, 2, 9 and 10. The male emerald damselfly has straight and narrow inner anal appendages and this is an important feature in differentiating it from the scarce emerald damselfly we'll describe in the next section. Both the male and female have brown pterostigma. The female has a metallic green bronze body, but lacks the blue prunescence of the male or the startling blue eyes. Emerald damselflies are found throughout Ireland, but more so in the west and northwest. They favour small lakes and ponds in low-lying areas. and Their flight period is from June until September. The scarce emerald damselfly closely resembles the emerald damselfly, but there are key features that enable differentiation between the two species. In the scarce emerald damselfly male, the blue prunescence is on segment one and only the front half of segment two, and is also present on segments nine and ten. The body is broader than in the emerald damselfly, and most importantly for identification, the inner anal appendages are broad and twisted at the end. The scarce emerald damselfly lives up to its name, and its limited distribution covers the Midlands and the Midwest. It favours seasonal non-permanent wetlands such as turlocks. It's also found in the backwaters of canals and in artificial ponds. Its flight period is from June until August. The large red damselfly is another of our easily recognised damselfly species, and indeed is the only red damselfly species in Ireland. The body is bright red and the eyes are bright red. The thorax is red above with yellow beneath, and there's conspicuous black markings and banding on the abdomen. The female comes in either black or red forms. The large red damselfly has an extremely widespread distribution across Ireland. It favours a wide variety of habitats, including bog pools, drains, streams, ponds and small lakes. It's the first damselfly species to emerge and its flight period runs from April until August. That brings us to the end of the green and red damselfly species. 
If you'd like to learn more about the other species of damselflies and dragonflies in Ireland, please check out our other online tutorials. If you'd like to get involved in Dragonfly Ireland and record dragonflies, damselflies, or get involved in monitoring, please check out our website at biodiversityireland.ie and click on the Dragonfly Ireland button.